Welcome to another edition of Chaplain John with Chaplain John Sayers, featuring special reports and interviews with people doing kingdom ministry in Tulare County and beyond. And now, here's Chaplain John. Okay, here's my thought for the day in five minutes or less, not counting the introduction. Actually, my thought for the day came from um, Brad and Trudy. They are really neat people. They, they are pastors of a, a little church, wonderful little church in Farmersville, Church of God. And Trudy posted something which got a reaction from somebody, which got a reaction from her husband, Brad, which obviously got a reaction from me. And here's what she posted the other day on Facebook. She said, Christians pray, we don't protest. We imitate Jesus, not Barabbas. We, we're, we, we call for revival, not insurrection. Take to the church, not the street. We kneel on the altar, not the curb. We are light of the world, not fuel for fire. Now, that's pretty good. And, and But here's the response she got from somebody on her Facebook. And um, he quotes Matthew 21, 12 through 13, uh, Jesus of the temple. Let me read that to you, familiar verse. Jesus entered the temple courts and drove out all those who were buying and selling there. He overturned the tables, the money changers, the, the benches of those selling doves. It is written, he said to them, my house will be called a house of prayer, but you've made it a den of thieves. And then he says, this was a protest. Well, that's interesting enough. Got a reaction from Brad. And I want to read you, he really good. You can go on their Facebook, uh, Brad Taylor, uh, uh, Trudy Taylor. You can find them on Facebook. But let me just read you a little bit of his reaction. Brad said this, let's don't leave out the religious leaders, silenced him. Uh, this was not Jesus' only protest. The life lost was his. The only one involved in protest was him. Jesus did not encourage anyone to turn against the evil tyranny, tyranny of Caesar and the Roman Empire. Wow. That's, what, that's not what Jesus did. He didn't call people to do that. Body of Christ, here's the message I got today for me. With all the anger and the going on in this world today, you know, even even before the coronavirus and, and people angry and mad and angry and you know furious. Body of Christ, let's not add fuel to the fire. Let's don't do that. But a light to a world that needs Jesus during these times. Let's be what Jesus wants us to be. Be a light, not add fuel to the fire. Thought for the day body of Christ. Let's be a light today. Amen.